Okay, guys, two things to take from that video. One, the ASO matchup, but in top lane. So we're going to see why some champions actually don't fit in top lane. And they're picked more often in lower elos than higher elos. Because in higher elos, people know how to punish them correctly. So here you're going to see I'm going to put ASO in checkmate situations. Because some champions do not fit with the length of top lane. That's what makes it strong or like weak and strong to be to play against. And the second thing is how well I actually managed to build my lead and then snowball it to victory. No death, no big mistakes. It's pretty much what you should aim for if you're getting a lead for yourself. Hope you enjoyed the video. Much love. <laughs>
because it's oh, it's actually ace on top because they have what Trin doesn't have. Trin doesn't have um, magic uh, damage and he doesn't have what's the other thing CC and they have magic damage and CC. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna focus a bit on the lane. Okay, I'm gonna actually like instead of pushing at the level two first, I'm gonna do something a bit different. I'm gonna let him push to me first and then go for an all-in. It's kind of what I've been doing against Nasus. Into Nasus, like I started by at first I was crushing the first two ways, letting it bounce back to me and then go for an all-in at level four. But then I realized that by doing that, well, the Nessus is really happy from level 1 to 4. But if I let him push from the start, well, maybe I can start push pushing from level 2 or 3. But here I'm concerned that if I actually E on him, it's actually going to fix the wave. I also don't want to give him, like, free Qs because now he stacks more uh, dust from Qing than from Eing on minions. Okay. Well, now, now is the moment. That's what I played for the whole time. Yeah, he lost the cannon XP already. And you see, if I go for a wave 2 crash and a bounce back, well, he wouldn't lose the cannon XP like he did. And he would be able to play a bit more. And now I need to make sure that I keep the wave in that state for as long as possible. When we get level 4, it's going to get easier also. I uh, probably want to deny the XP from these two. Nice. So I know that Jarvan is... I mean, I don't know it for a fact, but he's most likely pathing top. Which doesn't really make sense to me. And look at the CS dip already. Yeah, that's why you don't play ASO top. Wave is too long. Can get punished too easily. I'm gonna try to go for a dive here. If I can get an E auto. Yeah. That's gonna be way better. He has to base TP. If he doesn't base TP, he's just dead. Ah, it's okay if I miss the minion. I want to make sure that it crashes. Well, not the best execution, but you know. It works. He still has CP, so he's not gonna miss that much. It's pre-5 minutes, so it's not the best go for a plate here. But yeah, I would give him a choice. You either hit me or hit the wave. Ready to hit me, so he misses even more CS. With base now. I think I'm going tier 2 boots, so I can run him down. And long sword to have some damage. Okay, let's see, can I reach chat for a bit? Um, fair enough, man. I'm also gonna make the push back to GM here this patch. That would be nice, but I get so busy. Oh, yeah, like, I, like in order to get chat, I'm actually like organizing my whole life around it. Okay, so this is also nice to read that it doesn't come from a random like silver player. No offense to silver players, you know. <laughs> um, but it's like, okay, so you're actually a, a decent uh, ELO Trinomir player. So you've traded against decent players because that was my concern. Like, I think I can work, make, well, I can make Hell of Blades Trinomir work up until Diamond. I mean, even no masters, I think. Like, like, yeah, you can make runes work by just like having a scale gap. But if you're playing against decent players, that's it's even better to know. Not safe for work vignettes. So if it is for oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, sadly, it's not that type of content. People for me, but did you did you hear the song as well? Nice little love song. I feel like I cannot dive him, can I? Yeah, this champion does this. Okay. 
Well, maybe I will do the same thing as I did before. It's gonna naturally push the wave back to me. Oh, maybe we dive with the Amumu. That's another play. Pray for my bots that they don't get dove. But it's not coming! Uh, yeah, but now no, 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 it doesn't work. Oi, oi, oi. Okay, do you come now? But... <laughs> and I'm just, I'm just having terrible waves. Yeah, Aesol got two A's for free because of that. Plus, like, like we know that uh, Jarvan was bot. Hey, it's whatever. I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna do the same thing as before. Yeah, get your Stardust. Not your Starbucks. Okay, how's the XP? Okay, and now he's doomed. And I have ghosts. I guess it's fine. I have the freeze when I have ghosts. So I can actually punish. Yeah, that's why A so top doesn't work. Let me just thin the wave a bit. And base. I have a decent base. I don't need to go for more gold. Uh, I think I want to go straight. Uh, this is... Yeah, this is a bit awkward to have this as a base. But I want to go for straight, but I don't want to have Tiamat yet. I'm able to get kills because I'm freezing, so I don't want to not be able to freeze. Okay, well, if we deny the whole cannon wave by keeping the freeze, as I said, if Amumu matches Jarvan, good things could happen. I mean, yeah, it's cool, but you don't have follow up, so I guess maybe you do now. Yeah, I was scared that she was going to do that. Oh, triple man ult, insane, yes, but, but we cannot follow. And now what could have been an insane play? It's a terrible play. Draven has a shutdown. Cannot play for it without ult. Just gonna get some info on his pathing. I mean, I kind of want to invade Draven. He has trade though. They have flash. Probably doesn't have flash nor ult. This is not going to work. He's going to miss so much here. He missed the whole wave of experience. Mm, I guess if you want to contest those, I'm going to get Prayo. Okay. Shit. I'm just hitting them to get uh, to keep my fury up. Sorry about that, guys. There's some work going on. Okay, but can we take this? Nice. Actually, okay, he has TP. 
I was thinking about maybe pushing mid. Okay, okay, really good. Nice rotation. Got paid. I mean, again, it's the same thing. Like, yes, I'm missing the cannon, but I cannot afford to wait. Like, it's one cannon for Demolish Prog. What's happening, Rocky? Is it, is it because of cannon? Okay, I'm gonna go straight now. Yeah. But, I mean, as I said, like, I cannot really go for it. I have to accept my fate. Okay, yeah. Is Smolder scaling at least? Or in terms of stacks? 70 at 12? Meh. But as I said, like, Botlin was gonna go like this. They just had not today. Sorry about that again. I will mute my make, I think. Okay, next time they do noise, I will mute. Okay. I wanna play aggro, kind of. He's driving backing up. Well, I guess he isn't. Or is only respect like that. Okay. Oh, nice. Aso could have bluffed. It would have worked. Shit, he might have CP. Oh, he ulted. Die from that? Uh, I'm not sure where Javan is, so I'm just gonna take a really safe piece. Okay, let's go. Worry, second. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. I have a red buff to take. Oop. There's Drake in 238, I think. Yeah, we're gonna start stacking Drakes. I don't have ult, so I don't want to go too crazy. Another cannon missed. I would just let these minions deny some of mine before I start hitting. Okay, okay. What do now? Drake in two minutes. Most likely I want to be as strong as possible for Drake. But the issue is that I will not have the gold for Navori. Okay. It's Jarvan. Well, if my team is gonna move to bot. Yeah, he was here. Maybe I can hold mid. So I make sure we don't get punished for doing so. Yeah, if I didn't help mid or hold, um, we'll most likely lose two one. Okay, Smolder is going top. Guess I go bot. I really wish I would have. 
Uh, Navori, Roderick. Maybe if I can get the turret. Imagine I, I, I missed your cannon. I mean, still, I wouldn't get it. Or maybe I sell this 240, 400. You. Or we kill. Okay, if we kill that guy, we get the Drake. Okay, this. It's good enough. It's good enough. Yeah, it's gonna push, don't worry. Insane. I mean, I guess I'm level 13 to level 9, so can't afford to do that. We lost T1 mid though. It's the better dragon. Oh no, no, fuck off, fuck off. Just yonking my XP. Nice. Okay. That might have been the game winning play. I'm muting my mic because of the... Okay, well me bot now. I can probably take this on my way. Let's see, there's a Nash in a minute. I think I will probably look to... Either I'm diving or I'm bringing someone and rotating. I thought we could could have TP'd on the minion. Okay, I might have messed up, but at the end of the day... Like I, I knew I wouldn't die from that, and I guess they overcommitted for me. Okay, oh that's Nash. And for, for me, the worst that would have happened is that they used plenty to get my ult. Best that could have happened is that they were actually not backing up the Caitlyn and I get to pick. Well, actually, the best that could have happened is exactly what happened. <laughs> so that was even a better option, I guess. Okay. Get the guaranteed W. Right. I'm playing for next Drake. I don't know why we're fighting now.
blue buff is pretty big here because it gives a blue buff to my smolder and Dina is a blue buff to their ASOL. To good, really good reason to go for it instead of hitting T2 here. Okay, I'm gonna fast base. She doesn't know that I based. So they might look for me. And I move to Drake. How many stacks does Smolder have? 150. Oh, that's that's pretty low. Oh, it's okay though. Okay, let's not go crazy, I just be doing the objectives and if they come to us, then we kill them. I don't think I want to use my sums and my ult for, well, virtually nothing, you know. Maybe, okay, an extra T1, but we're gonna end up getting it anyway. Okay, nice. Uh, I see one, two. Okay, maybe I can afford to steal those. This. this okay emo we just we just played so we keep playing for objectives on the next Nash normally smother would have his 225 stacks and the game is gonna be very different. I mean, on one hand, I should have stayed to not sell my D-Blade, but on the other hand, like, the gold that I could get was super far from me. I would lose so much time. Not that there's a lot of uses to my time, or maybe there is, actually, if this game goes like this. Ooh. No, cancelled me. Okay, we end up getting them all. Almost. Okay. We couldn't have ended any way if we pushed mid. Or oh, maybe... No, I don't think we could have. Ah, maybe. It's whatever. Play for Nash. I got cock blocked so much it was sad. Uh, po -po 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 Let's get stronger. 
Ready that last fight. See, Smolder's stacks, 195 at 27 minutes. Case trolling. We should start Nash and turn on them if they come. Okay, use this mate. Yeah, we have vision in their entries. I mean, maybe he could have comboed here and then he combos again, but pretty unlikely. There's a Drake in 15. They're going to have position. I think I think it's better for me to just push. Return to end this time. Shit. Okay, they bring two. Follow my blade. Okay, well, let's wait for my team to be in a position to pressure. The worst thing that you can do is get caught now, same for away. Okay, nice try, I guess. Nice try. Okay, good shit. It was a pretty good one.